What's up, people? It's Franz, aka Grenadian Killer Beats, aka GK Beats, and I'm here, and I'm gonna do a quick tutorial on rooting drums when you're using Battery Three. So I have a beat loaded up right here. It's a beat I started on a little back, and these last tracks eight to fourteen are all coming to battery 3 which is where I load up all my drum samples and that kind of stuff yeah so I have all of that stuff coming through battery now if you open up the mixer you see all of the sounds when they're getting played they play through just one channel and that's not good if you really want to get in depth and mix all, every single separate drum piece that you used as a sample inside battery 3 so before you start up your session you have to load up battery 3 I'll show this on a new track to show exactly what settings put on multi timbral input go to battery 3 and you load it up as you could do it as a uh, one stereo 15 mono or if all your samples are stereo you could just put in 16 by stereo that just means that when you load up your stuff it means that you'll be able to route 16 channels from battery 3 into stuff okay so when you do that it creates a channel like this now you can add about up to 16 or in my case I have up to 15 so I just click plus 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 until it's done now we have auxiliaries 1 to 14 I think it should set it up automatically for you see instrument 6 3 4 5 6 7 those are all coming from battery 3 so let's see this is a kick to the router we go to cell usually when you're searching your samples and stuff it will be in browser first let's just wait for this to load up quick okay here we go so I just load up my sample sheet here da 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 so in cell you route it right here this is where all those tracks that I just sold you when I press the plus sign. So 3 all the way up to 18. So I have So I'll just do that manually. I'm gonna set up everyone to a different channel except maybe the toms. Or let's see. I'm going to set all the claps to the same one. I'm going to set all the claps to 6. To 7. Send this to 8. These 2 to 8 since they're the same or was it? Yeah, send these 2 to 8. Since they're pretty much the same kind of sound and sample. That's 9, 10, 11, 10, go to 12, and I'm going to send all of these to 13. Okay, now let's see. Now you see all the drum tracks are coming on different channels. So that's our kick. Kick. That's our second kick. Uh, kick two. Hit with snare. Our claps. Oh, I 
got her open eye hats, or one of her open eye hats, hi hats. I think this is her second all open eye hat. We'll see. It's a symbol. Our right symbol. Okay, second scratch. And our tongue. I'm gonna delete the leftover pluses, and there you go. Now you can add all different effects, things to each different channel, and only affect that certain instrument. Alright, there's that. So it only affects that channel. So next video, I'm going to show you how to do buses. So until then, later.